Okay guys, I have a humongous bag over here <laughs> and um, I was surprised uh, when it came today. Most of the time I don't check the details, especially the measurements. If I like the bag, it's like click, 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 buy. <laughs> and I was surprised when, it, uh, when I opened the package and it was like, oh geez, it's really, really humongous. Um, I have uh, featured another Celine Macadam uh, tote bag just uh, days ago and the size I would say is the same as this one. Um, maybe I should take it out and do a comparison because the, the only difference is that the other one is an open tote bag and this one has a zippered uh, closure. But I think uh, size-wise they are practically <clears throat> the same size but this one is just like really really bulky it's like a weekender bag guys um i was expecting it to be like half this size um silly me i never never I, I, i'm not into checking um those particulars especially the size <laughs> okay anyway um this is a celine macadam um vintage handbag and i'm very very happy to see this in a um very nice condition normally um they would be really really um super brown that means it has seen a lot of wear and tear but this one is it's just nice and i would say excellent condition now let's look at the measurements okay so um Oh geez, there you go. That's 12 inches over there plus seven. It's like 17 inches across, 17 inches in length. So you can just imagine that. And then 12 inches in height. Okay, 12 inches in height. And then this one is a more structured handbag because it has a very definite, um, I mean, it has a very a uh, sturdy base in the form of um, like this. <clears throat> it has four feet studs. Not that it matters, but this is a very structured uh, base. So uh, it's like five, four and a half to almost five inches in width. Okay, so what did or 17 by 12 by 5. So this is like a weekender bag. And look at the um, straps of this bag. Um, they're like an inch, in, inch wide each. So this provides, you know, um, this is very sturdy. So, um, okay. So I, I just love the... This is so newish, guys, because um, the zipper pull is really, really in very uh, shiny condition. Look at that, guys. There's just some, you know, wrinkling due to storage, but that's really normal. But uh, the, it has gold hardware and it's just really, really nice. Okay, so it has a zippered closure. And then, wow, well, it glides smoothly. Okay. <clears throat> Look at that. So it has another, another uh, zippered compartment and another open pocket on the other side. Okay, it says here, Celine Paris, made in Italy. And then M94. So the interior of the zippered compartment is um, like silk. I love it. Okay. And then this has just an open pocket. There you go. Ah. All right. So you can you can just see that it's really really, you know, in a very like excellent to mid condition. It's very rare that you get to um, you get to buy uh, an excellent to mid condition um, handbag. Um, this has no uh, peeling at all. So 
this kind of material tends to peel eventually it doesn't matter if it's um louis vuitton or gucci but this material will peel off i think that has something to do with the temperature or the humidity it just peels off and flakes and yeah there you go um these uh, these tote bags i have uh checked the prices of the real wheel they're like 600 25 dollars of course plus tax and shipping <laughs> 625 dollars so yeah this was uh, expensive too but it's not i didn't pay 600 dollars but uh yeah this is a week under bag it's like yeah it's good for traveling it's good for airplane guys <laughs> so it's really really huge okay so uh, i'm loving this guys okay bye